it has been said that for those aspiring for a career in the maritime industry, that the academy is a very good place to come from. But it is a school which is not only very difficult to enter, but also very much more difficult to stay in. True to the saying that there are many ways to leave the academy, but only one path will give you a sense of fulfillment, and that path is through graduation. Four years ago, the class of 2018 entered the academy as plebes and went through the process that thousands of their predecessors have gone through over the years. A lot of them stumbled along the way, finding out that life inside the academy was not suited for them. But those who proved their worth eventually moved on and continually improved. And now, finally, their training has been completed. The Philippine Merchant Marine Academy is steeped in tradition and ceremony. As one of the oldest institutions in the country, it has developed its own culture, which is a mixture of unique and borrowed traditions. The graduation rites are no exception, as it is the most awaited of all ceremonies in the lives of PMMA cadets. The graduation rites are traditionally divided into three parts held over the course of three days. First and foremost among these is the turnover of command. This ceremony is held on the parade ground and symbolizes the continuity of the Corps of Midshipmen. swords symbolize command, and as the officers of the graduating class turns them over to their underclassmen, so too do they pass on the responsibility of running the corps. On the morning of the second day, a baccalaureate mass is held. Faith in God has always been one of the cornerstones of Filipino culture, and as such, it is a normal thing to ask for guidance 
during trying times and to give thanks for all the blessings received. This is perhaps true for any religion. Although the Mass is a Catholic celebration, giving thanks to the higher power transcends religion and members of the graduating class who are from different denominations of faith were also present. Towards the evening comes the highlight of the second day, the ring hop. The class ring is a status symbol which is sometimes even referred to as the physical embodiment of a graduate's connection to the PMMA. When cadets leave the academy after graduation, they also take leave of the uniforms which used to identify them as belonging to the core of midshipmen. Only the class ring remains, which, when proudly worn during social gatherings, could easily help to identify fellow alumni. The ring hop ceremony marks the day wherein the graduating cadets finally earned the right to wear their class rings. To most people, the class rings might appear as just another piece of jewelry. But for those who went through similar experiences of enduring grueling ordeals just to earn the right to wear them, the rings serve as constant physical reminders of their experiences, the lessons learned, and the values inculcated while they were still on training. same experiences, lessons, and values will be the driving force for them to aspire to achieve success in whatever field they choose. After four years of dedication, perseverance, and hard work, graduation day has finally come. This will be the very last day that the graduating class will march on the parade ground in full regalia as cadets of PMMA. This day is the culmination of four years of intensive studies and training. It marks the completion of the process of transforming a cadet from a carefree child to a well-trained and responsible officer.
Graduation is often referred to as commencement exercises, primarily because this day marks the beginning of the rest of their lives as sons and daughters of their beloved alma mater. As the next generation of graduates and the newest addition to the long blue line, they are expected to bring honor to the academy by upholding the standards of excellence and professionalism long established by their seniors. And hopefully, when the time comes for them to lead, may they always be guided by the values held in the highest regard by the PMMA. Righteousness, humility, and 